Outing, you know, um, really competed well early in the game. Um, kind of get a feel for all his pitches, getting them working. Um, one thing I appreciate about him, you know, Escobar puts a good swing on a on a ball that, over the middle, and two run homer. You just want to see how guys react, and and uh, he didn't like it a whole lot. And he bared down and really was effective, and um, in even more attack mode, and made a lot more sort of getting a little more rhythm and more quality pitches. So it was nice to see him get through the seventh. You spoke earlier about managing with aggression from a you know a positive standpoint. Right. Of course, um, we saw more of that tonight uh, again with the uh, the triple from Ozuna. Was he thinking triple the whole time? Yeah, I don't know. A question for him, probably. Um, you know, you don't want a close play when that third out at third base has a possibility. But I do appreciate him getting out of the box and, and being aggressive and looking to make a play. So um, in that third inning, you bring it up. You're talking about two outs, nobody on. Yadi has a ten pitch at bat. You know, two strike double, and we had four straight two strike hits after that, and uh, ran the count up. Was able to do some damage, obviously, and um, really just quality of bats. Yeah, it's a similarity from last night too. I mean, you saw Bader with the big at bat, he had two out rallies. I mean, you think that that's just either seeing enough of the pitcher or just staying in an inning? And the focus that you talk about, kind of the present. I think it's staying present. present. I think it's staying, you know, in the competition, and and um, you know, they get to that point where you get two strikes, just you know. To, relax and bear down a little more and you know get into competition mode and those guys are doing it. and that was a great example last night with Bader and then a couple of times you know like I say Yachty and then uh, you know you got uh, Hosey you know looks at the infield single then Azuna then you got Paulie and then you got Jed all with two strikes just bearing down quality professional at bats. What could be a 10 pitch inning for Duffy into a 37 pitch inning for Duffy, I mean, that's it. That's the game, right? That's, that's the, I mean, effectively, looking back on it, that's the game. You know, and um, to his credit, he's able to still battle and get through some innings and, and make some pitches. And, um, you know, we had trouble adding on until till Harrison took a good at bat again and, and did the two-run homer to give us a little bit of a little wiggle room. Harrison, uh, the guys yesterday were talking about how he's an elite center fielder. Is that defense that can keep him in the lineup every day? Is it that level of defense? Right now, it's everything's keeping him in the lineup. He's doing a lot of things positively, but definitely, you know, looking like an elite defender. And you know, Metrowi checks out, but also the eye test just checks out. And this guy's um, into what he's doing. You know, a lot of the outfitters are really uh, communicating a lot, and doing their preparation work. Of course, Willie does his homework for the game and shares it with them, and he's really engaged. They're doing a good job working in concert with what we're doing pitch selection wise. And you know, he like say he's really gets good jump. He's got unbelievable closing speed. And he enjoys playing defense. Yeah. You know, and the thing about it is you're good at what you work on. And, you know, the play last night, Pop bought it up. You know, before the game yesterday, new ballpark. Anytime we go to a new place, we go out and get a, you know, familiarity with what's going on, the warning track and how it plays. And, you know, Bader's out there working to see how the ball's coming off the wall. The ball goes off the wall, comes back, catches it, boom, gets it right in, right back in. Nice shot right to the cutoff man. Keeps Escobar third, they don't score. I know we've got a lead, but at that point, you know, they get a couple runs there, you know, turns into a different ball game. So um, he takes a lot of pride in it, works really hard in it, at it, and, um, he's, you know, he's becoming a special defensive player. You mentioned that obviously he's providing offensively, but how much of that is the defense giving him the time to figure things out offensively? Well, I mean, I think it's hand in hand, you know. I mean, I think you always want to balance of your lineup, too. Um, but he's more than earned an opportunity to play what he's doing every day.